stained glass windows, a wondrous glory to God, and not bad curb appeal to that church or worship space. But what if there were more you could do with these cleverly colored pieces of glass? By looking at the potential of these pieces of glass in a different light, one Toronto artist is harnessing the power of the sun by installing solar cells into her work, transforming these pieces of glass into solar-powered windows. Stained glass artist Sarah Hall started experimenting with these energy-absorbing cells after seeing solar installation projects in Germany, where her studio is based. Now the concept is being put to the test here in Canada. With the Holy Family Catholic Church currently under construction in Saskatoon, it will become the first cathedral in the world to install solar panel stained glass windows. The cathedral is able to um, bring to the public a message about um, stewardship, Christian stewardship uh, of our resources. And the design is called, it's called Lux Gloria, and so it is about the transcendent uh, glory of God. When the Lux Gloria project is completed, it will collect as much energy as used in five homes for a whole year. That's powerful. But how exactly does this process work? The solar cell is embedded um, between two layers of glass. So it actually, and this layer here is called ultra white. It means that the most amount of light possible can then reach the solar cell. This is a safety glass, it's tempered. Then my art glass layer, which is a painted, uh, painted work, is essentially brought together in a, in a thermal pane. So we would go over to Saskatoon. This is Reverend Bill Bruce. He's the coordinating minister here at Ontario's Thornhill United Church. The congregation recently installed one of Hall's works entitled Gethsemane Cross. Although not solar, Bruce says he can appreciate the idea of blending environmental prowess within the frames. As a suburban congregation, we all get in the cars and drive a couple of hundred cars here every Sunday. We feel the dissonance. We know about that. So I think stained glass again would be a gesture of awareness. Hall Phil's Lux Gloria could open the door, or window as it were, to the beginning of churches across Canada looking to bring together the practicality of collecting energy and the beauty of windows. The solar energy collected by the Holy Family Catholic Church will be fed back into the grid and the cathedral will be paid for the energy, enough to help offset the building's electrical costs. This project in a sense is so highly publicly visible that it brings uh, solar energy and, and the fact that there's no greenhouse gases uh, connected to it. It'll push things uh, in the public mind and, and we hope that then it will actually um, push the utilities to give better rates for solar. I think there's a whole bunch of things that are connected to this. For folks here in Saskatoon, those bricks are coming together. The Lux Gloria project is on schedule to be installed late spring, with the cathedral's completion date set for later this year.